welcome guys welcome to another video of chilling with lady d so this morning you get the water running my hands are clean but i still went and i washed them okay i washed them all right Man, I'm making some porridge. Two leaves of cinnamon. We're gonna wash them. I put them in my little red pot. The lid is clean, you can see it's still wet. And cover it. Alright. So this morning I'll be making some cornmeal porridge. Yes guys, some cornmeal porridge. So over here I have my stuff. Washing off my little grater for my nutmeg. So it can go ahead and dry. Let me see if it's videoing. Yes, it is. Can I look lean? Can I straighten it? Yeah. Okay, so I am leaving the water to boil. In the meantime, I'm gonna get a container and mix all the caramel into it. So, for now I'm just gonna use one of them circle cup here. Or, might use a little basin, a little dish. These are wash, but I'm gonna rinse it out anyhow. Put in the caramel and the Maggi coconut powder, of course. I'm trying to get the water to a boil. And remember, guys, the two cinnamon leaf is in there. Let me give you a view. Right there, yeah, it's not a, a lot of porridge, so the two cinnamon leaf will do. Okay, I hope you can see because it's a back camera. So, I'm gonna pour some carne here. Carmel. Yeah, this is the carmel. I'm gonna put the coconut powder inside of this and stir it. Mineral water boil. Okay. Bite my bite it. Then use my finger and open it out. But I cut it because I have a scissors in the kitchen. So I mix the two of them together. Right? And I'm going to throw the sachet in the bin. Wash my hands because they don't, the packaging can't avoid anything. So I'm going to add some water. So here I have some water in this. So I'm stirring the cornmeal. This is how I make my porridge. And the, the milk together so the both of them boil. 
you know, together. So this is my want a little bit more water. Cause guys that eat a porridge with lump. I don't know anybody else leave a comment in the comment section. I don't like porridge with lump, my love. I mean I like thick thick porridge, me I tell you from now. So if you see the porridge not thick up and lump up on the I can't buy a porridge, me a king stone here. King stone and I like them porridge. Well for me. Like our porridge to tick up. Right? I might add a little bit more water so it flow easily when it is going inside of the pot. And I don't think it needs any more water. So I'm just stirring around the edges to make sure I don't leave any any um cake of cornmeal in the edges, you know, because a square not a square a rectangle container. So we add a little tip more water. Okay. So this is my mixture. So this is the cornmeal. So guys you can see the smoke coming from the pot. I was going to lift it up, but I know that you can see that is now come to a boil. This is well mixed salt. So we're gonna lift the lid. And guys, it's about six o'clock now in the morning before work. So, so guys, just stir as soon as you put it in, just start to stir. Okay, you don't, and you don't want a lumpy porridge. I don't want a lumpy porridge. So as usual, I keep my hot water in my kettle. I'm gonna pour a little bit here and I'm gonna pour it here. So you're gonna leave it to boil. And guys, you usually know when your porridge, oh, I see a lump, guys. You usually leave your porridge and you can know when it's cooked. The bottom will feel you know, it's like you hear this a draw. So I think I'll find that lump. As I tell you before, I don't like it. So yes, you will hear the arm. Um, it's like you hear this now when it's cooking and when you hear the pop button that's smooth. Alright, so I'm gonna... Yeah, once we see the lump, may I take them out. Even though it can be from the coconut milk, I can start boiling. And leave that to boil for a minute while I rinse out the container. Add a little water in it to keep the spoon into. So you drain it, so the spoon is right here. So everything that I think I need, I already put right over here. So guys, this is the porridge. You let me I carry some go work to you know oh, I'm coming at the micro here yeah, for my lunch. But mostly back in the grey porridge. That's for some time. I have to eat in the mood for porridge. So guys, the coconut milk powder and the caramel together is rich and half body. They know it's gonna start boil and simmer. So I'm gonna leave that to boil. Put my spoon into a container of water, and can I ask my pot because you don't mean to cover a pot, but they don't know. Watch, watch, porridge a pot. Me turn it on medium. Yes, guys. So I'll see you in a bit. So this is what it looks right now. Yeah, this is what it looks like now. Yeah, it's creamy and nice. I'm gonna add a piece of butter to it. I put my porridge in a piece of butter, guys. Just a little piece of butter. And this is gonna be really rich and nice. They keep stirring and stirring. So I'm gonna get my guys this is what it looks like now coming together with the, the coconut powder and the porridge sorry and the cornmeal 
right this is what it looks like so i always add a piece of butter to my porridge so i'm gonna do that now i'm gonna put back the stand in place let me make sure that you guys can see what i'm doing okay I always like to put a piece of porridge. Guys, piece of butter. Guys, me not have my talking now work, you know. So guys, try this in your porridge. Put a piece of butter in there. Alright. Put a little piece of butter in your porridge. And so I'm going to start. For your buttermilk, then you taste for salt, because you know that butter carry a little salt. And you don't want to add too much salt. Alright, and it's refined cornmeal, guys, so it's it not going to take that long to boil like the original coarse cornmeal. You know, everything modern, modern now, I'm modified and go through all kind of process to make things easier. So. Yes, and the butter is in it, it is melting out. I put the fire on low, I'm going to turn it back on medium. Have the fire just stick to the bottom. And I was around here constantly stirring. I'm watching TG Jakes in the morning, I think it's about two seven now. All right, so. Just the salt, the taste of salt. Who knows a porridge burn at? Mighty God. Woo! I'm afraid we touch it. So it's still need a little salt. Yep. You know you have to wipe as you go along. And they have one e power. They're not going. What about it? Guys, when you know it's a black pepper, this may just strain your porridge. <laughs> No, let's see if we can take off the top. Uh, no, sir. It does not grab. Then we go like a iron chef. I go like me iron chef. I look on the back, you know. Because the both buckles are the same. One is salt and one is pepper. So we have pepper porridge today, guys. I mean, I take it out. The whole small, so not too much salt. Guys, when you ever see this, hmm? you cut my black pepper and dip it in the milk, my sister. So that the salt comes out of black pepper. So, guys, you know that the refined coming don't really take long to cook. But my little small little thing, they soon boil right out. So, as I tell you before, I don't like lump and I don't like a thick porridge, I told you before. So in the meantime, I did not take long for boiling, guys. Remember I said, watch, I, I break the camera and keep times off. So what you're seeing would be more time for me. I have more time than the camera time. I like a sweet porridge, guys. And I'm gonna have this with some bread. See that make here some of our work in from my lunch. Tambourine season. Nothing. Here's some for me and King after school. You know guys never add me little sugar. But I want to see how far the milk carry me. So in there, so far for sweetening, we have the coconut milk. So I have, this is the look after adding the, the, um, the candence milk, the Betty candence milk. This is the look. So guys, I'm still sweetening. Alright, let me come up here. Uh, guys, you can try for them in full though. 
Ma bella come fra, ma c'ho. Ma bella fra, ma c'ho. So I want to see if no. So I put a little sugar. So I had put some sugar in this. Guys. Nobody judge me. Some of too much sweet, but I enjoy the price of it from Charlie Chu. So we need to turn up the fire a little bit now. See what is going on so far. Okay, so I'm gonna close the milk. And a little tubs of sugar. It never sweet, sweet guys, me not like. Me nervous cause you now watch. So here I'm on the loss of my vanilla. This is the vanilla. Benjamin I love of course. So I'm on the last, I need to get one at the supermarket, so I can just pour this in. A little rose water, guys. So I'm just going to use the card for measuring. Of course, Benjamin. Okay. Stirring. So guys, I'm stirring. Let me go. So guys, smell nice. Smells really good. I'm gonna try to get a reaction when I'm tasting it. Cause this morning I realized I don't taste anything in front of you guys. So I'm looking for my not men. Then I have to crack the shell. Throw the shell in the bin. Uh -huh. Then I have the little grates are here. We are with the side rough. And you go ahead. And you're great to have a nutmeg, a spice. Nutmeg gives you a spice, guys. Okay, that's enough. So the great I was well washed and put up before. So I'm just gonna wait before I store the nutmeg. Alright, so this is what is going on at the moment. Alright, so guys. Trust me, I make a really nice porridge. I'm gonna do peanut porridge for you one of these days as well. Oh. So here we go. So now we don't need an eye fire now, because it's already cooked. So I'm gonna turn it back down and leave all of the flavors to come together. You know, when I say I love the little red pot, I have more pot, you know? But I love the little red pot. You know, when you see cooking and going on, you see the little glass top, coven, you can't see in other pot. You know, there's a little something there. I never really have one. I must see one. The glass pot, one never really have my shop. They're not so cute. Alright, this look I came like on. Something miss some. Mm -hmm. The guys, not for me. Just get the egg. So, guys, 
you'll see me back when I'm plating some to drink this morning. Right, God, this is not a Sunday morning when I don't eat before. I'm going to have some of this for breakfast. So, there you go. See my dong. So, guys, this is the end result. Yeah, so I'm going to allow it to cool. And I'm going to share. I'm going to do a little video while I'm drinking it. With my little bread. My like my parched bread. Alright. So, I've not plated anything and eat because I must do this on a Sunday morning. When I'm going to church and I don't eat that every before I go to church. So, I would take the picture when I'm back. But you know, I need to take the picture then I have to put more rice on it. Because you know, I have belly as so I'm gonna share up my porridge. So see you in a bit. And it's caramel porridge coming from chilling with Lady D's kitchen. Pick up yourself. Guys, I care porridge gotta work today for my lunch. So I share out share it out. I'm walking my two slices of bread. Whoa, me wash up back the butter, guys. Me don't want it, but me. But it's so I can part you gotta work. And guys, I'm gonna try to get rid of it, open so we clean up. I'm gonna tell you so I mean, I like one pick parish, but I don't know nothing no. to kill me. So I have throat enough so King can get so many come from school. Got them my, my girls them you know them. Them that catch this when it at. You come back home see guys. You see the little bit. I'm gonna wash out the back of before so it's okay if we scrape the spoon on it. Um you see the little bit of rice and please I'm cooking at this. Guys, me not do um dinner Sunday and the gas done. So they just throw me off. I don't want to fill up this at too much porridge. Yes, so I never done now. I'll wash off the top. Wipe it off. And then wash off the buckle. Wipe off the top for it. And then wash off the buckle. Okay, my break that work. So, now I'm going share. Like I'm going share my king on it now. That same little plastic here. Got me up with the feeding, guys. So, guys. So I'm going to share this. It had a big something here, we're wide. So I can share some for King. King, come out of the camera with the knife. Yes, guys. So I leave some for them. They not drink nothing. Not one cup they might drink. We could have come home, come see this. I tell you. Them not catch this when it well hot. That's it. So guys, so guys, the king there. See there, I bleached on the porridge. See my bleach the porridge. See the porridge. So guys, so guys, let me just take a taste with my local kite at you
Mmm. That is my favorite Amazon man, but look for me. Guys, I don't try me make it. Whoa, watch it, watch it. How we go? Go for the top of you. Guys, I'm a step. Bad. Tastes good. Right flavor, everything. Sweet enough for me. Yeah, so. Mm hmm. King, I get for you. So. You will see me again at lunchtime at work. Okay? Later.